and was Weyua, 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 chosen ones, but with another powerful and productive video, right? Great. Someone is leaving you all because you are a caring person. You are a loving person. You are a good person. You are so kind. You are empathetic. You have a forgiving heart. You are so trustworthy. And this person is leaving you because of all these good qualities that you possess, that you have. Chosen ones, I'm here to tell you that if you have all these qualities, you treat people right, you don't treat people wrong, you don't mishandle people, you don't abuse the love of people, and people want to walk out of your life, want to go, allow them go. Allow them to leave. Chosen ones, you must know one thing for sure, that you can never, ever, you know, try to convince, excuse my language, a pig that pool water that is clean is better than a dirty, mud water around. Yes, never ever try to wrestle with a pig because you will get dirty and besides, the pig likes it. All right, great. What do I mean by this? This is a proverb. This is deep. This is a pregnant word. All right, you need to ponder over it before you understand it. You see, by nature, there are people that are created like that. The spirit in them is not the spirit of God. So they don't like good things. They don't like loving things. They don't like forgiving things. They don't like a heart that forgives, that loves, that cares. They don't because some things aren't in them. You see, it takes wisdom to recognize a person of wisdom. It takes a knowledgeable person to know or recognize another knowledgeable person. Yes, it takes a good partner to appreciate a good partner. So a partner that is bad, that is not good, will never appreciate you. You will never be enough for such a person. No matter what you do, no matter how hard you try as a person, you won't be enough for such a person. Let me tell you the reason why people leave you. You see a lot of philosophies, a lot of beliefs, a lot of life coaches, and they'll be like, um, if you want to leave your partner, if you want your partner to leave you or to lose your partner quickly, care so much. Love them so much, forgive them so much, and you will lose them. Right? Great. So, this is teaching us that, you know, people that is in them to not be good will never be with you a good person. All right? It is not because you are a problem. No, you are a loving person. Don't forget that. You are a kind person. You are a gentle person. You have self-control. You are a committed, dedicated person to whatever you're doing. You act as if you count. All right? And you are a good person. All right? But it is because this person is leaving you because this person is a bad person. It's not good. That is why they say, oh, people like bad people. Yes, I've come across several philosophies of that nature. Beliefs that people will be saying, oh, nice guys always lose. Nice people always lose. Yes, it is not because nice people always lose. It is because the person in your life is not a nice person. So the person will not be able to appreciate how nice you are to them. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this is deep. So, the person will go out there to be with a bad person. Because that is who the person is. So, that is when this philosophy of belief, like begot like, that is like attracts like. You attract who you are. Yes, that is it. And when you look at it on a more deeper level, you will see that this is true. This is real. People attract who they are. So that is why if you are a nice person, all right, someone will choose a bad person over you. It is not because you are bad. You are nice. You are a good person. You are a loving person, a forgiving person, all right? You are a, the right person for the person, but the person is wrong person for you. So wrong cannot be God, right? <laughs> I believe you, you, you get in it, all right? So wrong cannot attract right. Bad cannot attract good, all right? Great, so... The person will go and choose a bad person over you. It is because, yes, they attract each other. They begot each other. Right? Like attracts like. So, that is why. It is not because of anything. You are not a bad person. You are not the problem. I'm telling you, you are not the problem. They are the problem. That is why. So sometimes you wonder, all right? You are like, why? So they will go, they will leave you, they will pull away. And later, later in life, when age is downing on them, before they will realize that, hmm, this <laughs> It's not it. I've left something valuable, a gold, a diamond, and I'm, I was busy collecting marbles, pebbles, stones. That is what. But at then, then it becomes too late for them because you too, you will learn new things, new ways. You will study about the nature of the opposite gender so now you know how to deal with them. All right? So you too, you now focus on yourself. Some will, not, will, will even have the intention of not to settle down again, but to focus on their God and to focus on whatever they're doing and make sure they, 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 they are great at it, they become successful at it. All right? And that's it. So I'm here to tell you, if someone leaves your life, it is not because you are a bad person. You are a good person. But they are the bad ones. That is why they couldn't appreciate you. Yes, it takes light to comprehend light. And it takes darkness to comprehend darkness. All right? So... That is it. Sometimes people leave your life not because you are a bad person or you are the problem, but because the mighty one that is dwelling in you is irritating the demons in them. The light in you is brightening, shining on the darkness in them, which at the end of it will expose their dark nature in them and they will feel uncomfortable they will feel embarrassed they will feel ashamed and disgrace so they will better leave you they will betray you they will disappoint you they will reject you they will choose a different person over you don't worry don't worry i'm telling you you aren't the problem you are never the problem they are the problem. So, never try to wrestle 
with the pig. You will get dirty. And beside, the pig likes it. So never ever try. Never try. If they want to go, allow them go. Okay? Allow them. I believe the explanation I've given in this video has given you some understanding about yourself, about your life, about why that person left you, why that person choose somebody else over you. All right? So, focus on yourself. Put God first. And I tell you, everything is going to be well with you. Yes, you are going to succeed. You are going to blow. You're going to level up. You're going to make it. Great things are coming your way. Yes. Whatever good, whatever love, whatever good deeds that you've, you've done to people and they didn't appreciate it, don't worry. It's a seed you've sown. It will pay off in a different way. It is being pressed down. It is being multiplied. It is being shaken and it will be given to you at the right time. When you least expect it, it will come. All right. So don't worry. Don't get heartbroken. I've given him so much. I've done so much for her. But she did not appreciate me. He did not appreciate me. Don't worry. Don't despair. All right. God is working out the answer. Believe it. That your best is always yet to come. And God knows best. So what will be detrimental to you, to your growth, to your advancement, to your breakthrough, to your healing, to your deliverance, to your salvation? God is going to remove it. So when God removes all things, allow it be. Don't force it. Right? Don't force it. Listen to the proverb on the pick. Ponder over it. It will give you more understanding. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you for watching this video. See you in my next video. I'm out for now.